Hi, and welcome to Learn English Lesson 12. Today, we're going to be talking about useless words and common phrases. Okay. Useless words and common phrases. All right, now, what I mean by this is when you say the words true facts, true facts, you don't need both the words together. The word, the word in the bracket true means the same as facts. So you don't need to say them together. We got true facts here. All you, all you need to say is fact. Okay. okay, next example, return back. You can either say return or back. You don't need to say, need to say both words at the same time. I am returning back from the concert. I am returning from the concert. I just got back from the concert. You don't need to say I just returned back from the concert. All you, it, you can be more precise and more concise by saying, I just returned from the concert, or I just got back from the concert, or wherever you're, you're getting back from. Now, next word. Next words. Next useless words in common phrases. Circular in shape. You don't need to say in shape because it's already circular. We already know that it's circular, and we know that cir a circle is a shape, so you don't need to say in shape. You can say in shape, that is in shape, I am getting in shape, but you don't need to say I am getting circular, circular in shape. Though it does sound pretty cool to say. The next example, at 3.30 a.m. in the morning. There's no real reason to say in the morning because you're, you are already saying a.m. after midnight, which means morning time. So it's, it's redundant to say in the morning. You just got to say it's 3.30 a.m. or it's in the morning. Okay, next example, red in collar. You don't need to say both these words. There's a useless word here, words, and it is in collar. All you need to say is red. That book is red. You don't need to say that book is red in collar. Next example. But, though, but, though, I've never really seen this before, but just use one of them, not both. Bitter tasting salad. It's bitter, so the word bitter is a taste in and of itself, so you don't need to say tasting. It's usually bitter dash tasting, but just say bitter. The salad is bitter. That is a bitter salad. It tastes bitter. That salad tasted bitter. Bitter tasting salad. You don't need to say the words in the brackets. So to review, we got, this is a Ling Learn English Language 12 channel. We're talking about the useless words and common phrases. An example, true facts. You don't need to. You don't need to need to use. <laughs> you don't need to use the words in the brackets. So we got true facts, return back, circular in shape, at 3:30 a.m. in the morning, red in color, but though, and bitter tasting salad. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this lesson, this English learning lesson or whatever. I hope you enjoyed it, and you can follow me on YouTube. Where this video is going to post and Google Plus. I'll, I'll do some um, live Google Pluses from here and there, like doing the alphabet, counting numbers, and stuff like that. Just fun stuff. All right. Thank you, and uh, add me in the circles on Google Plus and uh, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Thumb up, thumb down, comment, um, favorite, share. Yeah. Thank you, and I hope I at least teach a little bit of a native, uh, a native speaker like I am, 28 years, and 
we're going on 29 this year and uh, if you if you include the nine month nine or ten months in the womb about 29 and a half 30 years or whatever native speaking so all right thank you